What's going on guys? Jordan here coming back at you again with another episode of Beer Reviews. Tonight we're going to be doing a review of the Hoop Tea Spiked Iced Tea. This is coming in at 5% ABV. This is a 16 fluid ounce can. I saw this yesterday uh, by chance at a local liquor store that I was in. I was trying to find the, uh, the four pack of uh, Guinness in cans. Walmart didn't have it, so the liquor cor the liquor store across the street, I figured they did, and they did. And then I saw this, and I had to pick it up. So, uh, it's got a little story on the back, which is kind of cool. Born on the boardwalk, it all started in an old ice cream shop on the boardwalk with a couple of friends who quit their jobs and moved to the beach. We wanted to live a life as free-spirited as our hometown with some tea leaves two kegs, and our toes in the sand. We begin crafting a little taste of ocean city sunshine, and from there, Hoop Tea was born. We hope you enjoy drinking it as much as we enjoy making it. Cheers, Danny and Billy, Hoop Tea founders. And this is uh, made with real black tea, apparently. So, Hoop Tea, let's see what it's got. Let's see what it's all about. Let's pour it up. It definitely smells like tea. Yeah, that's 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 definitely tea. That smells pretty good. Let's get it in the glass. And I am a pretty big fan of hard tea. I've had a I've had a few different brands of it. But uh I think twisted tea is my favorite. Maybe this will be my new favorite, who knows? It, it smells like pure tea, like tea leaves. That, that's all I'm getting. I'm not getting any alcohol notes or really anything else. I'm literally just getting tea. It smells really good, actually. So, uh, let's dive in. Cheers, guys. Hoop tea. Wow. That is a really good, sweet, a little bit of like an undertone of lemon. No alcohol. Wow. Wow. Okay, so I literally just said maybe this will become my new favorite hard tea, and I think it just did. It's sweeter and has a better flavor, in my opinion, than Twisted Tea does. It's a really sweet and just, like I said, it's got that, like, slight undertone of, like, a lemon. That's really good. That is very good. If you are someone who likes sweet tea, with the exception that you like a little bit of lemon in your tea as well, you're going to love this. This stuff is absolutely incredible. For a hard spike tea, this might be perfect. For me at least. Wow. Wow. I mean, I almost can't even put it into words how good this stuff is. This is absolutely incredible. It's just sweet tea with lemon. That's what this is. There's no alcohol. I don't get any alcohol notes. I don't taste it. I don't smell it. It's incredibly smooth. It's super drinkable. It smells phenomenal. Like if they had a candle that smelled like this, I would buy it. Really refreshing. This would be good on a hot summer day, good at the beach. I might have to actually pick up some of this and take it with us on our uh, Panama City Beach trip in uh, August. 
this, this is really good. I'm not going to lie. If you guys can find this in your area, I don't know how far they distribute. Uh, it says brewed by Hop Tea in Baldwinsville, New York. So, I mean, it got all the way to Missouri from New York. So, I'm pretty sure you can find this just about anywhere. I don't know how popular this brand is. It seems like I've heard of it before. I'm just not quite sure. Maybe I've seen some people review it on YouTube. But I can't be completely positive. Uh, as far as a rating, guys, I'm giving it a 10. I think it's a perfect beverage. I think you could really get messed up on this stuff really quickly. So be careful if you get it because I could I could drink that whole can in no time. Like, I could chug this and it wouldn't be a challenge really. So 10 out of 10 from me here at Beer Views. If you guys enjoyed this video, be sure to give me a thumbs up. And if you guys have any suggestions on anything you would like me to try in the future, leave it in the comment section below and I'll do my best to try to find it and give it a review. As always, until next time, cheers and thanks for watching.